I've finished cleaning up the frame, ready for the new polycarbonate to go on. I must say I'm quite um, quite pleased with it. Getting quite addicted to this Autosol aluminium polish cleaner. Uh, when you start doing it, it um, becomes quite a satisfying job. So you can see from the result there that um, it's just got rid of all the tarnish off of that uh, original aluminium and back to something quite nice to work with. So the next stage is um, I've got myself a hole cutter. So I've got a polycarbonate offcut here, which I'm going to have a little practice with and see how well that cuts before I start um, doing anything with the new polycarbonate sheet. So let's see how that goes. Um, so that 45 second clip you just watched actually took about 45 minutes to an hour but uh, I took the point of view that it's better to take the time and uh, cut it out rather than wreck a 70 pounds piece of polycarbonate. So we've got it out, what I've done is uh, I've overlaid the other piece of the original screen over the top of the new piece of uh, polycarbonate. I've just put some little stitches of uh, masking tape all the way around just to hold it in place and I'm just about to start drilling these holes now. So uh, here we go. I think that's okay. I'll clean that up with some wet and dry and we're all good. pleased. Um, all the holes lined up for all the rivets because we were so careful using the uh, the old screen as a template. Uh, it's taken about a, a week just filling around in the evenings after work but it's all on there and it's all done. So it's ready for refitting back on the aircraft when I finish doing some other bits and pieces around the cockpit. So yeah really pleased with it.